we're here tonight because we've got an event planned that is going to blow your socks off, and it's called Salsified Funk. And the reason we put this together is because our country is at a crossroads. And we, as Generation Obama, the young professionals in this United States, we need to make a difference, and we need to make a difference now. That's why we brought together Grupo Fantasma, Less Than the Funk Mob, at the most amazing venue in Austin called Antone. an experience perspective, obviously McCain does have some background, but his divisive policies may be more destructive. Um, obviously what we're coming out of was certainly not um, a coalition approach to foreign policy, and I think it'll be a really important to get somebody in office who can uh, work with a lot of the, the other nations worldwide to help solve a lot of these geopolitical issues, and certainly Obama brings that to the table. For me, this will signal the first time in our history that a minority, someone of color, is actually taking a leadership role and will truly represent me and my family. You know, when my grandfather told us that he had to drink from a different fountain than whites or because he couldn't play baseball on a pro league because he was Mexican, that to me, it signifies that I am just as important as everyone else, that our leader cares about every single person, race, ethnicity, religion, and that is something our country has never had before. crowd and it was a crowd that looked like the state of Texas. It was diverse, it was beautiful, it was hopeful, it was optimistic. And I said, if you can win the presidency on a foundation of this constituency, one that has never been represented in American politics before, you can change the world. I think the young people, if you haven't figured it out, politics affects you, <laughs> whether you want it to or not. When they, when they do something wrong with our economy, it affects your jobs, your dad's job. You can't go out as much, you can't go to the movies, you can't pay for your gas. So I think if you haven't realized it by now, you are affected regardless of what you, I'm not into politics, you are in politics. You're into politics even if you're stupid, even if you don't do anything. Someone's speaking for you right now, even though they don't know you. So. The best way to do it is just go ahead and be heard. I'm with the Texas Democratic Party. I work in the communications department and we're all just very excited to see all the enthusiasm we've been seeing this year and very excited to translate that enthusiasm to um, victories up and down the ballot this November. Obama. I uh, think Obama. You know, I'm all for Obama. Just look at the picture, Bill. It's very clear. Right? You got old school, new school. Go with the new. <laughs> <laughs>